Okay, that was fun. <laughs> and look how far you've come. Got the timing right this time, and the ref didn't see a thing. If you had used the chair that fast in our match, I would have been done. I still don't like it, but I see your point. Fighting dirty is necessary sometimes. That's my girl. Knew there was a little rebel in you, LJ. And now that's settled, we still need to decide how we're cashing in our briefcase. Our? Nice. And it's about time we finally have this conversation. But who gets to decide how we do it? You want to face me in the ring again? Whoever wins gets to call the shots. I'm ready. Nah, not when I'm starting to think you might not be the worst person ever. Generous. <laughs> Let's take out our aggression on other people who are arguably worse than you. A beat the clock challenge. One of us takes Raquel, one of us takes Shotzi. Whoever wins faster gets to decide how we cash in. I love it. I'll face Raquel. Then I'll take Shotzi. Best of luck, partner. It's the superstar who's driven to live up to all the hype. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Newcastle upon Tyne, England, L. Guys, this match has the potential to completely change the WWE landscape, and it's because of this level of talent involved. This is a woman ready to do some damage. Raquel Rodriguez, a massive presence in the women's division. And from Rio Grande Valley, Texas, Raquel Rodriguez. And NXT Rodriguez won the first ever Women's Dusty Rhodes Tag Team Classic with the first ever NXT Women's Tag Team Champions. Well, Cole, you can bet Raquel has some more firsts in store for the main roster. tips with me. That's okay, Saxton. You couldn't survive Raquel's warm-up. After reacquiring their stolen briefcase in a tag team match, Ava Moreno's partner is now facing Raquel Rodriguez one-on-one, -on -one, while earlier tonight, Ava took on Shotzi. Maybe they wanted to teach Raquel and Shotzi individual lessons about stealing? It feels like something other than morality is at play here, especially since these teammates have decided to turn this into a beat-the-clock challenge. And Ava set a tough time to beat at 3 minutes and 47 seconds. <laughs> Another oh, one for good measure. Well, some might call that showing off, but what a display. What a way to flaunt your abilities. Air whip! It couldn't have felt good being chucked around like that. Double underhook applied, up and down, face first. And Raquel's resolve might be wavering here. You gotta wonder, what does this do to Raquel? <laughs> the middle rope, what a best press, and now dropping bombs. Brutalized. 
capitalized with kicks from the Deville combo, Saxton. Looking worse for wear in the corner now. With an uppercut. Oh, hanging on for dear life. Oh, you power bomb. That might be it. And she's gained total control of this match. She's looking unstoppable, actually. Double underhook applied. Up and down, face first. She might be in some trouble now. Yeah, Cole, but at this point in the match, you still have it. Lift off. Oh, big height on that move, so. Cover. Two breaks the count. Somehow she's still in this matchup. It's unbelievable. Boot to the stomach gives them separation. Tough break, LJ. But a deal's a deal. You weren't able to beat my time. I've got a plan to cash in the briefcase. When you're ready to make a move and go for it, let me know. Fair is fair. Will do. Ready to cash in the briefcase for our tag team championship match? I've got a great idea. I'm ready. No time like the present to become champions, right? I don't know what you have in mind, but as the first ever tag team briefcase holders, we need to make our cash in memorable. Something the WWE Universe will be talking about for years to come. I could not agree more. I don't want to just win the championships. I want us to be in the WWE Best Money in the Bank cash in highlight video. You won the right to decide how we cash in. So, what's the plan? Remember how we lost the briefcase to Shotzi and Raquel? How could I forget? Let's do it again, but this time on purpose. Would be a shame if anyone thought Asuka and Tamina stole it. Could give an enterprising tag team an opportunity to strike. Especially if they found some extra security guard uniforms lying around. Hmm, sounds a bit silly, which is exactly the sort of thing you'd see in a best of video. Precisely. And the best part of that best of moment, when it's over, we'll be walking out tag team champions. Another decisive victory from the tag team champions, Asuka and Tamina. Just a second, Byron. We're getting some breaking information on a possible security issue. 
seems that the reported theft of the tag team Money in the Bank briefcase has been linked back to the champions, Asuka and Tamina. Well, that's one way to maintain your momentum. They don't even have any evidence. They need to get their hands off the champs. What's going on here? That security guard found the briefcase. It was never stolen to begin with. Hang on, that isn't a security guard. That's Ava Moreno. And Ava's partner is behind the champs in the ring. This is all a plan. Are you kidding me? This is foul play. Call it what you like, but it looks like they're cashing in, and I, for one, think it was a brilliant strategy. Asuka and Tamina just defended their titles and now must compete again. I get being a little devious to catch in your briefcase, but pretending it's stolen and dressing up as security guards, that might be a step too far for me. What's wrong with a little calculated cosplay? I agree, Byron. When it comes to cash in in a briefcase, nothing's off limits. And besides, you still have to win the match. Brutal face buster. Into the corner. This can't be good. the suplex the champ looking out of sorts and yeah it's about time to heavily consider tagging in that partner incoming cross landing power bomb you have to question what kind of malintent is behind a power bomb with that much force she anticipated that one she got launched An absolutely foolhardy decision made there. That could be very costly. Don't know if the risk was worth it. And she's using this moment to summon all of her strength. Looking for a little bit of high risk here, it seems. From the top, she had it scouted. Through the air, it connects. Big time risk pays off. The daredevil in you comes out when you take risks like that. Driven into the barricade. Oh, and a reversal. Hanging back with their own count. And guys, she's dangerously close to a count out loss. And now dropping the bombs. She's firing up, no doubt about it. And now she delivers her back into the ring. Vicious, 
sent into the corner. Landing the uppercut. Just using their foot as a weapon. So ruthless. with that maneuver. Drop right on their face. And she's gone after her opponent's core a few times now. Oscar's being overwhelmed. This has to be a bit demoralizing for the Empress. And it looks like the new champs are soaking in every moment of this championship celebration. And after what they faced to get here, mostly each other, they deserve it. 